what's going on folks we're out here on location and I finally purchased me another set of fins for my uh, fin drive here and I don't know why my, when I bought the kayak they didn't come with the logos but it don't really bother me but we'll get you a close-up and you won't be able to see on there but these rods have managed to protrude on both sides had the rod sticking out right here coming out and i have to i could do it in the field and the best part is you don't need tools to uh, fix this as you can see these split rings here and uh, as for me i have i don't cut my nails too short so i'm able to do it with my fingernails but there there is a tool Look, see, I already got that one started. And uh, all you gotta do is pull that ring out right here. And this just drops right on out of there. Get it from the other side. And bam, slides right on out. See that oyster bed mess? But check it out, folks. Check it out brand new right there and you know what the best part is the price i got a pair ordered a pair from the van hunks website fifty dollars fifty dollars with ten dollars shipping that's sixty and uh that's what you're going to be paying for a hobie fin for just one so they're say getting a good deal and actually them hobie fins will fit on here as well but and i almost played with a crazy idea of putting some on there but nah these will work just fine i haven't went to the store to check them out and they feel the same way there's it's the same thing oh and check it out here it didn't really affect my performance but I know a redfish got stuck on there with the line and ended up doing that slice and I've had it like that for a long time but finally now I'm gonna change them out today hopefully I don't tear them up too bad today all right folks see you here in a, in a minute and let me show you I forgot the I mean they just go on right here and if you ever got to take these rods out, this is where you put your crescent wrench or wrench and twist. But for me, I, I've bent them before. I've hit some oyster reefs and I was able to pull the fin out and I could do it on the kayak itself and bend them back. But my buddy of mine said you really shouldn't be doing that because you could break the whole deal. But I've been lucky, I guess, and I haven't. But you just slide this on like that all the way and get it this here to align there to put your pin in and your snap ring in and bam you're back in business all right and there they are folks all right we're here in my stomping grounds the fish habitat and we and the only difference is we got a high tide today oh, and my buddy herb was telling me at work that he wanted to try this spot and he's already out there i told him it gets shallow no you don't like to you don't like to paddle <laughs> he said oh yeah he's like, my buddy's there telling me that all these reds are here I, I think he just watched my video from that one time i was here and, all the stars aligned <laughs> but uh yeah we're gonna flutter it now i might be able to go try to take it easy on these brand new fins but uh let's see what we can see and uh, we'll start the hunt we're on the prowl now That were they nibbling? Oh. 
Ah. Oh, There's one there. They turned around. Turned around. Turned Might have been one right there. The mud boils. Ah. Uh, on the Jedi. No, Herbie, don't leave. The number one rule is never to leave fish to find fish. <laughs> and the lesson books. of them running there we go big old schools coming my way fast too look at that ready they're coming towards me and I'm gonna get it ready into position already and hold it and hold it so they get, they're coming, they're coming. Coming, coming, right there. Amy, ah, oh, they turned around, damn. Must have seen me. God, I spooked them. They must have seen me. Son of a gun. The wig bait spooked him. Car. Uh. Direction. Now I'm thinking. Oh, look at that big old back right there. Should I go for that one or this one? Let's go for this one. Uh. Got a trailer here that way. Oh. Putting out vibration, but not going for it. They turned around again. They turned around again. Now they're coming towards me. Oh man, they are in feeding mode. This may be my last shot. Look at that big old weight. God dang. So that cast is true. Here we go. Man. See if I can get it in front of them. They're coming. They're coming. Put it right in front of them. Right there. No. No. One more chance, maybe. Right here. Put it in front of them. They are not. Right here. One more time. Finally. Golly. Ooh. Stick them. Good. <laughs> that is my cup of tea fishing right there being on the hunt y'all kept showing yourselves Whoa. Yeah, 
should have brought the net. Yeah. If you ain't got mud on your paddle, you're not going shallow enough. <laughs> Got full of energy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let me see if it's a keeper. Be close. Oh. I got you. I got you. <laughs> Damn. It's, didn't want to give up. Oh, yeah. Get you with the menu. Beautiful fish. Why are you gonna, yeah, why are you gonna let it go? Oh, yeah, it's a why are you gonna let it go? <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. Where? Right here on the corner. There they were running. When I got right here, there was a shitload of them right here. Mm hmm. Over here. That's why I didn't move because I saw you working this way. Torquing. Right yep. You were fucking all right there. Same shit going back and forth. All the shoreline. They ain't biting on my shrimp. Nibbling. Nib back to us. No, it's a good rush. Yeah. Hey, he just got out here now and he got one. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> all I hit was a 19 and a half. Hey, Yvonne, I call me a 22, baby. Four oh, star. A four star? I can't see it. Oh. 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 Day! <laughs> Four dots, baby. All in the line, too. Four. Is your net stained, Joshy? <laughs> All right. Now it's loosening it up. Oh, look at that. Oh, she was a dolphin. Do you see that? Look. You see that one? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think it's trying to steal your fish. What is it, Joshy? A bobbit. A bobbit. What kind of hook these? Uh, uh, like it depends on the size of the shrimp. Of the shrimp pimp. Of the shrimp. Oh shoot. Of the shrimp pimp. <laughs> the shrimp pimp. Got a hook right here, doggy. Doggy. Is that, are those from Bass Pro Shop? <laughs> what about those dead scripts? The dead scripts? Well, which one should I use? What's that? No, 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 I'm gonna give you live stream, bro. But what am I gonna keep them in? Huh? <laughs> am I live well? 
Yeah, some good dr red drink. Yeah, but that's all. <laughs> that's all your drink. <laughs> no, it was hot. Oh. Just chum up the water a little bit. <laughs> With red. Uh, Go ahead and set it up, bro. Oh. Park right here. Well, let me. Uh, I got you. You can pull up right here next to me and tie off. And tie off? Can I tie off? Yeah. <laughs> well, put them in the deal so I can put them. Uh, yeah. Are those, were those Herbie's uh, shrimps? Yeah. I got a lot more. Uh, has your net ever stained or you cleaned it right after? Yeah, I'll wash it. Can I smell like cigarettes? Oh, huh? does it smell like... Oh, because I throw my cigarette butts. Do you smell? You don't pollute in the water, right? Yeah. Yeah. Here we go, baby. Here we go. Yeah, I got a half of this one too, bro. Here we go. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this trap. <laughs> Here we go. Oh. Another truchon. Trucha. That one's a keeper now. What do you think that one is? 16? Yeah, yeah, another 16. Ah. Another 16er. <laughs> Good job. I taught you well. Right, Joshy? <laughs> a, sp yep, a speckled belly. Yeah, this one looks chunkier. Nice. Man. 